So most people can't go to the gym without say a Red Bull, a Monster, some kind of energy drink, some kind of pre-workout. Me personally, I can't go to the gym without my gym bag. So I thought let me put down this video of what's in my gym bag because every time I go to the gym, this scenario always happens. Oh, hello. Uh, do you want to put your bag in the locker? No, it's all right. I kind of need everything that's in the bag. Are you sure you just don't take it out and put it in the locker? No, I really actually do need everything that's in the bag. I mean, it's got loads of things that I use throughout my workout. So if it's fine, can you just leave me to train? So you don't want to put in your locker? No, I do not want to put it in a locker. Every single time I feel forced to put my bag in the locker, but I actually have things in my bag that I need to perform my workouts properly. So, let me show you what's in my bag. But bearing in mind, I've used this bag for a lot of things, not just gym workouts, so there's probably some random stuff in there. I decided to leave it all in there because everyone does these videos and they, they like to lay everything out and say, this is, these are these wraps. I use these uh, knee sleeves and uh, yeah, they're fantastic. And then over here to the right, I use uh, these wrist wraps. Now, it's all just dashed in the bag. I'm gonna take you through my bag. I don't even know some of the stuff that's in there. So this is gonna be a surprise for both of us. So, you know, let's do this together. Together, like friends, because we are friends, aren't we? All right, so I have my gym bag right here. Let's take a look. All right, so in my first compartment, I have my water bottle. I got this from bodybuilding.com. I think it's called the Enviro bottle. 2.2 liter bottle, very handy to keep you well hydrated whilst you're training. All of this stuff I'm gonna put in the description box. I'm not affiliated with anyone. It's just if any of you guys want any of this stuff, I'll let you know where I bought it from. Got my foam roller. Any of you guys that haven't used this before, this is great, especially before you train legs, to massage your legs and get them ready for when you train. This is perfect. I have my Innovate, my Fast Lift 335s, Olympic lifting shoes, very sturdy platform, a lot cheaper than the um, Adi Powers and the Nike Romelos, and they still do a good job. Can't complain, can't complain, very good. I have my lifting belt. I actually don't even know where I bought this. There's a guy that walks around the gym that sells gym equipment, and I think I bought it from him. But Biomax, never heard of that name. But if I can find a link, I'll put it in the description box. A random strap, I think a Oh yeah! I use this to stretch my legs. So I wrap, I put this around my foot and then pull, you know, for PNF stretching. Second compartment, I have my wrist straps. For machine fitness, this is the only thing that I'm affiliated to and I get a discount off of. So if you guys want wrist straps, they're really good. I mean, you've seen how much I deadlift and how much I rack pull and I always use them and they haven't snapped like other ones. So I've got the gray and the red. I don't know why I've got two pairs. I guess if I want to coordinate my colors, then I change it. Yeah, two sets of those. I got this, which I think I got from the Physio Room, a website called the Physio Room, which is a patella tendon strap. So a lot of the OG subscribers will know that I, I suffer from patella tendonitis. So this actually, this gel pad sits on the patella tendon just underneath it and it relieves the pain. It does relieve the pain. I haven't used it in a while, but it's always good to have in your bag. I have a... <laughs> A pass from FIBO 2014 for when I was sponsored by Grenade. I have my knee wraps. I bought these ages ago from a shop in Croydon which is actually closed down. Um, but I'm sure these, these are by Maxi Muscle. There's normal knee wraps. I've had them for about three years. Maybe even longer actually. I think about four years. But they've done the job and they don't stink. And I've got my iPad which I use for my music. On to the next compartment. I have my headphones. <laughs> Anyway, these are Blue Dio Turbine Bluetooth headphones. I think they call them Hurricanes also on Amazon. I got them off Amazon, they were 22 pounds. Nice, cheap, um, sound good, good quality, very happy. I also have my old headphones, which a lot of you kept asking me about these ones. These are called Urban Ears. Um, I got these in Shoreditch at the Box Park. So any of you guys in London, the Box Park Shoreditch, there's a shop called Urban Ears and you can get those. But they're wired. And deadlifting with wired headphones, I cannot stand it. I don't like it. I have an energy drink. This one specifically is Red Thunder from Aldi. I always have an energy drink in there. 
I also have um, an elephant fridge magnet from Thailand. Final compartment. I have a wristband from Fitmark. Should just wear it, but you know. I have comics to make my lips soft and supple. I have my IFBB international passport for when I compete abroad in whatever show I do. So this is when I did the Arnold Classic in Columbus, Ohio. I have my business card, my social media card, and a socket. And finally, a random piece of paper, which was my old to-do list. That's what's in my gym bag. As I mentioned at the beginning of this video, I'm not affiliated with any of these companies apart from Machine Fitness, which was for the wrist strap. I'm gonna leave, I'm gonna search for links. This is how good I am. I'm gonna search for links for everything that I've got and where I got it from, and I'm gonna put direct links in the description box because I'm helpful like that. So if you guys have seen anything in my gym bag that you feel I could use that in my workouts, or I could have that on my fridge, but not really for this one. I don't, you'd have to go to Thailand. Unless you're willing to go to Thailand, I, I still don't even know what shop it was. That's all I use. I don't like to complicate my workouts with too much equipment. I just use the essentials. And I like to keep things affordable because that's the type of guy that I am. But if you like this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you leave your comments in the comment section below. Share it with your friends on Facebook and Twitter. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll catch you guys. Remember to always be true, no matter what you do. I run it, I never front it, I got my own.